We're here at the Erin Arts Center at Bentonville High School where Joe Wilson's natural bodybuilding show is taking place. You can see some of the competitors behind me. They're all getting ready to go out on stage. I've competed a few times in Chicago and I can't wait to see how they do it right here in Northwest Arkansas. So let's get out there, check out the event and talk to some of the competitors. So we're here with David Hernandez, one of the competitors at today's bodybuilding show. David, you look familiar. I think you were part of our segment for the wrestling event. Yeah, so I do both. So. Okay, that's crazy. So why wrestling and bodybuilding? Um, you know, you need a good body for wrestling, and so bodybuilding, wrestling, right? They go hand in hand. I was 210 pounds in college, senior year of college. I, I I couldn't even take a shirt off in public ever, and so I was like, I need to change, and this was a change I needed. I'm doing men's physique, which is more like the board shorts, not in speedo. Symmetry, athletic look, it's not just looking shredded or not completely looking bulky. Uh -huh. You gotta find that good combination. I'm here with the one and only Joe Wilson. I'm sorry, big Joe Wilson. I like it. Thank you. <laughs> How you feeling? You just got off the stage. Yeah, I feel great and had a really good time. I get, was able to guest pose with uh, six of our IPE pros. Wow. Um, bodybuilding, physique, classic, and then also we got the women's figure, the women's bikini, and then also our women's physique. Had to walk in heels. Very <laughs> interesting. This is Joe Wilson's natural bodybuilding show. You're the promoter of it. How many years strong now? This is our 13th year. Wow. So it is a pro qualifier, which means that the people who win their open class become a professional athlete, and so they can compete for money. The funny thing is that I met you once I put your name out there to my friends. Everybody knew you. You've got a big following in this community. Well, uh, I do try to work and try to help others, try to serve others, try to keep them aware of just some of the health and fitness options that we have in Northwest Arkansas. I do follow more of the bodybuilding facet, natural bodybuilding, so I always love to share people information that as long as it can benefit them, I'm happy with it, they're happy with it. I'm a teacher. And so I love educating people in that in this process of body physique transformation. Hey, we're backstage with Sadrina Shaw, one of the competitors here. So have you been working with a trainer or is this something that you do on your own? Um, my coach, I have a coach. Okay, what does that coach do for you? He um, keeps me on track, keeps me motivated, makes sure I'm doing my workouts, um, telling me if I'm slacking or not, basically keeps me motivated. Okay. You promoted this now for 13 years, but before that, you were up on stage as a competitor. Correct. My first year I competed was in 1999, where I won the Northwest Arkansas, uh, just the Northwest Arkansas Classic. So I've been competing from 99 to about 2004. I won Mr. Northwest Arkansas in the Open Class. Took about three years off just because I started a family, started teaching, and then when I started promoting the show, my very first show, I said, one day I want to be able to guest pose at my own show as a pro. And so I ended up getting my pro card the following year was able to guest pose at my own show, guest pose at a lot of shows around North, uh, just all over the Midwest. Won the Mr. Arkansas show, which is that I'm the first legitimate natural guy to win it. Wow. Uh, very proud of that moment, and then also did a couple of shows uh, in Kansas City. And so now I'm ready to come back and have a little bit more fun and trying to show people it can be done at, even at 40 years old. We're here with Jack and Tony. Jack is a men's physique competitor here at the show. Are you excited? I'm very excited, so I can't wait to get out there. And so is this your first show? This is actually my second show. So my first show was uh, last year, and you know I just was itching to get back on stage and just give it another try. And who's this guy next to you? Uh, this is my dad. This is Tony right here. So how are you doing? So is Tony your trainer? How? What's going on here? Yeah. So uh, he kind of got me into it. So I used to hate going to the gym when I was uh, when I was younger. He was always going to the gym, and now it's like the opposite. But I'm pu I push him. He pushes me. We're here with Randall Johnson. He is the oldest competitor here at Joe Wilson's Natural Bodybuilding Competition. But I'm going to be honest with you, you're not that old. Well, not that old. It's age. You, you really can't, uh, you know, judge a book by its cover. You have choices to make in life. Uh, there are better choices than others. And I'm promising an example of choosing things that probably benefit you in the long run. What would you say to aspiring athletes who want to get up on that stage but they're just so intimidated by it? Yeah, okay, the first thing is you got to have that passion. You got to make sure you know what you want. If you have a goal when it comes to your fitness and your, your health and, and just your fitness and health goals, find out where you want to be at, when you want to get there, and then if it's something that you're not familiar with, talk to somebody. Congratulations on turning 40. You look better than most 20 year olds. And the reason you look like this right now is because you did some guest posing. You want to finish off with some of your best poses for us? Sure. 
Hope you guys enjoyed that look at Joe Wilson's natural bodybuilding show here at the Aaron Arts Center, talking to the athletes, seeing a behind the scenes look at everything it takes to get up on that stage. A lot of hard work happening here in Northwest Arkansas. I stole this, so I gotta go before they catch up with me.